Okay guys, welcome to Chiang Mai night market tour time. Pretty cool looking right there. Have to say. This is right next to the shopping mall, right there. We're gonna take a look around here, see what we can see. Apparently there's a lot of food. It is really big. But I haven't seen any food yet. I'm sure that'll change. It has to be food. There's a lot of clothes with elephants on it. <laughs> That's for sure. Check that out. Pots of rice. You wanna grow your own rice? You can do it in a little pot. Apparently. How cool is that, huh? A lot of bars here in the back area, small little bars. It was not very busy, not busy at all when I was there. Uh, I don't know if they get busy or not. It looked all right. It looked like a nice relaxing place to sit and have a beer and relax, you know? But as you can see, a little quiet right now. Actually quite a few little bars and lots of tables. Probably busy uh, uh, later in the night. I assume you can buy food in the front. We'll show you the food in a minute. Bring it back here and have a beer and a bite. And have a cheap night out. Lots and lots of tables. Like wouldn't be set up like this. I don't think if it didn't get busy at some point. Now we get to the food. If you've never tried the Thailand crepe, <laughs> it's different. All kinds of mystery stuff goes on these. It's up to you. You get to design your own. They're cheap and uh, different. Worth a try if you ever get the chance. Just like that, it's done. Can't remember the price, but they're cheap, popular with kids. But there's tons of food here, tons and tons of food. You just you just walk around and look, pick what you want, pick what you uh, think looks good. Pick something that you've never had before. It's a good place to experiment. Everything is uh, clearly marked, obviously. Not necessarily on the prices, but these places are normally not rip-off joints anyway. You know it's going to be a good market if there's bugs. Lots and lots of delicious bugs. <laughs> Should have some. You might like them. Plenty of seafood. Prices are on this stuff. Looks like scrambled eggs she's got there, I'm not sure. It all looks good to me. Look at that, that's a plate ready to go. A variety platter, looks delicious. Lots of fried stuff. You know the fried stuff is good. It's <laughs> the fried stuff is always good. Uh, prices are on most things, you know. And as you can see, reasonably, very, very reasonably priced, considering it's a Chiang Mai tourist market. Chicken hearts on a stick. Now you're talking. Look, some gizzards. Oh, all the good stuff is there. Some intestines. A cool fan. Those are to keep the flies away. Probably not needed after dark, but it's there. Check out this pot. You think that's spicy? Yeah, it might be just a little bit spicy. 
uh, Northern Kanonjina, I believe that is. Three different varieties. And all the fixings to go with it. It's like a soup that you have with rice noodles. Looked like she was counting peanuts. Chiang Mai sausage, sausage on a stick. It was really, really good. I bought some and I went back and bought some more. <laughs> it was that good. I had seconds. Uh, cheesy fries, they actually look good. Uh, many different kinds. Uh, they look good, I didn't try them. I went for the Chiang Mai sausage. It was delicious. All right guys, there it is, another market. A lot of markets in this area. I have them all listed on the blog post. Link is in the video descriptions with maps and all the information. And uh, if you're interested in this stuff, check out my uh, Chiang Mai page. And as always, thanks for what. what